Best Netflix hidden gems to watch this weekend. Bounty hunters. I've been on. Ten. The Big Four. A by-the-book detective investigates the death of her father and follows a clue to a remote tropical island, only to find out his true identity as a leader of a group of assassins. <laughs> now hunted by his enemies, she has to team up with the crooks her father had trained for retired, down on their luck assassins itching to get back in the game. Nine. Below zero. On a lonely road, a prison transport is brutally assaulted. Martin, the policeman who is driving, survives and fortifies his position while the con men search for a way to finish him. A lot of bad reviews seems to be from USA where everyone goes around with rifles and automatic weapons. In Spain, no one can use firearms, not even the police unless under serious threat. In fact, in Spain a policeman can only unload his weapon if he is shot first. Taking that into consideration, this is a good story and it seems wildly based on a real Spanish case. Eight. Riddick. Bounty hunters. I've been on. The infamous Riddick has been left for dead on a sun-scorched planet that appears to be lifeless. Soon, however, he finds himself fighting for survival against alien predators more lethal than any human he's encountered. The only way off is for Riddick to activate an emergency beacon and alert mercenaries who rapidly descend to the planet in search of their bounty. The first ship to arrive carries a new breed of merce, more lethal and violent, while the second is captained by a man whose pursuit of Riddick is more personal. With time running out and a storm on the horizon that no one could survive, his hunters won't leave the planet without Riddick's head as their trophy. Seven. The Pirates, the last royal treasure. The Pirates, the last royal treasure is a 2022 South Korean period adventure film directed by Kim Jong Hoon and starring Kang Ha Neil and Han Hai Yo Ju. A spiritual sequel of 2014 film The Pirates. The film is about adventures of pirates who gather in the sea in search for the royal treasures that have disappeared without a trace. Six. Operation Finale. Save the country I love from being destroyed. Director Chris Waits's historical thriller is based on the story of how a group of Israeli secret agents arrested notorious SS officer Adolf Eichmann, the man who masterminded the final solution in Argentina. Oscar Isaac plays the legendary Mossad agent Peter Malkin. And we will warn off any who may wish to follow his example. While Ben Kingsley plays his emotionally manipulative arch nemesis, after tracking Eichmann down to Buenos Aires, Malkin and his men captured him and brought him to Israel for a historic eight-month trial. It's justice. Perhaps forever. Five. Unlocked. Unlocked deals with a serial killer with incredible hacking skills finds a smartphone on a bus. He starts stalking the owner of that smartphone learning everything he can about her in the span of three days and starts his sinister games of ruining her life. The poor girl who is clueless about being watched every second of her life becomes an easy trap along with her dad. In the meantime, police are chasing the serial killer after finding the dead bodies and the prime suspect being the son of a detective. <laughs> Four. 
Will the cop save the girl on time or the psycho gets to have his way? Forms rest of the story. Oh. <laughs> Four. Beckett. No, so we'll my, my friend, come on! While vacationing in Greece, American tourist Beckett John David Washington becomes the target of a manhunt after a devastating accident. Forced to run for his life and desperate to get across the country to the American embassy to clear his name, tensions escalate as the authorities close in, political unrest mounts, and Beckett falls even deeper into a dangerous web of conspiracy. If I do that, I'll be dead in 30 minutes. 3. Narvik, Hitler's first defeat. April 1940. The eyes of the world are on Narvik, a small town in northern Norway, source of the iron ore needed for Hitler's war machinery. Kämp för att vad du har tjänat och dö om så det gäller. Through two months of fierce winter warfare, Hitler is dealt his first defeat. Two, the stranger. A friendship forms between two strangers. For Henry Teague, worn down by a lifetime of physical labor, this is a dream come true. His new friend Mark becomes his savior and ally. However, neither is who they appear to be. Each carries secrets that threaten to ruin them and in the background, one of the nation's largest police operations is closing in. 